갑자기 내게 나타나준 너난 아무 말도 할 수가 없었지 첫눈에 봐 How you doing? Hope everybody's doing good. I'm doing good. Um, it's morning. It's rainy. It's drizzly. Whatever. It's nasty out. So, I thought I'd come on here and share uh, some happy mail I got. Um, I watch Lizzie Brewer. If you guys don't watch her, I'm going to link her in the description below. Check her out. She's awesome. Love to watch this lady craft. And she has lives on Tuesday night and Thursday night. And she's, she's fun. She's entertaining. And she, she does beautiful tutorials. Anyway. I could go on and on, you guys, because I just love this lady. I love watching her videos. And so, anyway, the second. Made me some coffee and thought I'd come in here and share what I got. Uh, on Miss Lizzie's channel, she does uh, cigar boxes, stuffed cigar boxes, and sells them uh, on her videos Etsy video it's on her videos I believe anyway uh, she gives the information when you watch her videos I was watching uh, about a week ago on Tuesday night I believe she was doing sorry for the lighting light Let's see oh well it's gonna shine in my glasses no matter what and I can't see without them you guys anyway I was watching her video uh, her live stream and she was uh, doing her um, cigar boxes. And they're so nice, you guys. And, and uh, you know, we were chatting back and forth in the chat. And a lady on there said that she was getting one for her sisters. Anyway, I made the comment. I wish I had a sister like that. Because... My, my family, I'm the crafting person in my family. I don't have anybody that crafts. I thought my granddaughter was going to get into it, but um, <laughs> she's a newlywed, so she's kind of put crafting to the side for now. But anyway, this beautiful lady, and I believe her name was Joy. I hope I got it right. I think her name was Joy. She bought me one. I could not believe the blessing. So, I got it in the mail. Um, Miss Lizzie sent me my box. So, I'm coming on here. I want to share with you guys. I hope y'all understand what I'm saying. Because sometimes, the way I say things don't make a doggone bit of sense to anybody but me. But anyway, it come in this... Um, it was wrapped in this... And in some bubble wrap. So, it was wrapped really, really good. And I took it out of everything because I thought it would help, you know, things go quickly. And this is what, what I got. So, we're going to get into it and we're going to see what's in it. I haven't even opened everything yet because I wanted to share. So I'm going to put my camera down uh, on my table. Forgive the mess around everything because I have been sewing mask, making mask for my family. So I've been using my desk for cutting. That's why I haven't really done very many uh, videos in my craft room because I've been doing a lot of sewing. So I'm going to put the camera down so you can see. Forgive my hand. Okay. I believe we're taping. <laughs> if we're not, I'm in trouble. Yeah, we are. Okay, this is the way it comes. Let me see if I can do this a little better. Can y'all tell I got my favorite shirt on? I paint and everything in this shirt. So, anyway, it goes like this. She pinned it, this little 
um, fabric uh, string around. I love this. I will. I'll use this. <clears throat> Here. And then it's got a snippet row. Let's see. Let's see how to take this apart. <laughs> oh, okay. It's all one piece, you guys. That's cool. Look at that. In there. She she puts these on so that she puts a journal. She makes a homemade journal and puts it in with it. And, and then she puts these in so that you can use it to, to wrap around your journal as you fill it. So, that's what I'm going to use mine for. Okay, I'm going to save the journal for last. Let's get into the box. If I can, let me figure out how it opens. This shouldn't be difficult, right? <laughs> Okay. All right. I'll be right back. Okay. Sorry about that. I figured, you know, I had to fight with this for a minute. Uh, one of the nails has come loose. I don't know if they dropped it when they mailed it, but it, it's, it's wood. I can just, I can fix that. That's not a big deal. So, I will put that nail right back in the lid. But look at this, all this goodies, you guys. Oh, I can't wait to get into it. As I share my coffee. Okay. Okay, this tells about the cigars. The original... Okay, it's a little small, and I'm having trouble reading it, so I won't waste time with that. I'll deal with that later. Oh, look, she sent me die cuts, you guys. I hope y'all ain't in no hurry. This might take me a little bit. Oh, I see a butterfly. I love my butterfly. I'm so excited. And some gears. Oh, look, you guys. She did these stamps from her stamp punch. And then there's some dies. The um, gears. Okay. Okay, let me lay these aside so that I can show more because these are pretty cool. Look at this. There's an owl and a butterfly. Look at that. That is so cool. And there's a bicycle. Sorry if my hands are shaking a little, you guys. Look at that. so cool. My husband probably thinks I'm talking to myself again. A dress form. Um, I think. That's what they're called. And a bird. Oh, I love it. There's another bird. Another owl. Let me get him up there. And some little birds. These are going to be awesome in a journal. And I just happened to have gotten a journal to work in. Another bicycle. That's an old one. Music, one of 
one of them you crank up and it would for music. Love that lady. And coffee cup. There's another wheel. I hope you guys are seeing these okay. These are awesome. I have to show them one at a time. They're just too pretty not to. I'm not going to skip them. So. Oh, wow. She took some awesome stuff. There's some more gears. Okay. Put those right there. And then there's some tags. Guys, she, these she only asks twenty eight dollars for these, and she sends all of these goodies, and you get a journal with it to to work in. It says after dinner trivia question: Who was the president of the United States when an American first walked on when American first walked on the moon? Was Nixon. It gives you the answer down here. It's a good thing. She gives me a bunch of those, so that'll be fun to do with Hayden when she comes back over again after we get free from this lock-in or stay-at-home order. So there's a lot of those. And then here's some more. I watched her making these, you guys. Like I said, she does a lot of this. I'm, I watched her make these on her channel. These are made with piano. I think it's old piano um, sheet music, if I'm not mistaken, that she used. And then here's some um, cards, um, like signs. paper to put in. There's a teddy bear. <laughs> and love to all. It's an old postcard. This postcard is very old. Um, printed in Germany. Uh, doesn't, doesn't have a date on it, but look at how vintage. It's so old. this dually and here's some some papers scrap papers I can put in I mean she gives you so much that you can put in your junk journal here's a this a, a envelope uh, pocket like she put couple of tags in it. Look at that. So all you got to do with this is just glue it down. You know, if you don't want to put it in the journal that you get from her, you can put it in your in, in one that you're making. But it's the work's already been done. She already did it. All you got to do is put some glue on it. Here's another one. Look at that. I have to try making some of these. That'd be fun. And there's a card. There's another card. Ooh, I like that. A, this is an index card that she stamped. And then she, um, she inked it. I maybe is what she did. Oh, look flower and it's a um, like an applique a coffee pocket 
She gave me some CD pockets. These will be good to go in a journal to put goodies in. Ooh, I like that fabric. Here's another pocket. And she makes this stuff, you guys. She does a lot of this. And then, and I think she shares things that she gets, too, that people send to her to use in her journals and her sharing. But look at all this little um, trim. All different kinds of trim. And then she sent a bag of, it's got all kinds of buttons and a googly eye and some rings and just all kinds of little things in here to use. And here's some more trim. This is like the yarn that you buy. You know, that's something I cannot crochet with. I've tried. Here's some more ephemera. figure out how to open it and we'll just glance at it I don't want to lose any of it tag and there's some tickets And she sent me some pictures of Femra. You guys, I've been wanting some of this stuff like this to put in on scrapbooking and journals. Some more tickets. All kinds of little goodness. Butterfly drop. I hope you guys can see this okay. Look at the people. Got some people here. I think this is Tim Tim Holt, the people, uh, ephemera that, that's here. Look at that. Like I said, she's very, very generous. definitely sends you enough to where you can do your own journal. A couple pieces that got left. I hope y'all see this okay. It's hard to, when I have my camera down facing the table, it's harder to see everything. So, I don't really know until I upload it if I did a good job. Here's a sign. It's probably in there. Another tag. She sent some lace. Two different kinds. Another tag. Uh, another postcard. I think she stamped this one. This is Detroit, Michigan. 12-2-19-15. From Lucy to Hazel. That's pretty cool. Some, I think these are dragonflies. And another postcard. Those are just awesome. And she leaves the other side is blank, so you can uh, put this in a journal and you got something to write. Paper clip. Oh, good. Some blank tags. So you can make your own tags. And one of her little pockets that she makes. Oh, there's the dragonfly. I bet all the dragonflies were in this pocket and they came out. And these are these are like metal. Look at that rose. I think it's a rose. And then there's that one. There's some flowers. These you can take apart and use. 
some more tags. Some of the ephemera that she made. It's a paper clip. So you can clip it. It's cool. Another tag. And then there's some cards. Oh, these are cute. <laughs> and there again, I think these are like, let's see, apples to apples, it says. Poison ivy. Itching for a walk in the woods. <laughs> so this has like little sayings on it too. There's something else Hayden and I can have fun with. Yes. See that would make a, this would make a really cute bookmark. So the work's done. And tag. Another tag. Some tags. These are like raised on this side. There's a fence. I told you she puts a lot in these boxes. That's a index card that you can put in your um, Philodex, whatever it's called. There's some vellum with the with, uh, saying, only so far as a man believes strongly, mighty can be act cheerfully or do anything that is worth doing. But I'm not sure of that one. A more. In time of tests, family is best. I agree with that. And we are being tested right now. Especially for you. Here's another. I think this was an old time card. Maybe. Maybe. Another card. Slip of paper. This is really thin, like tissue nearly. Punzanella, I think that's how it's pronounced. Awesome. I will be saving that. couple of little pieces, different kinds of textures. There's a, oh, it's a card. How awesome. Oh, and I got one of her business cards. Lizzie sends hugs and blessings to you and it gives her address. Uh, Scrapping Lizzie. Lizzie Brewer is uh, her YouTube channel is uh, Scrapping Lizzie. And she also has a Facebook group. It's called Scrapping Lizzie Unicorns. So check her out. I'm telling you guys won't be sorry. And she will be listed in my description below. I promise. Look at this. What I'll do is I'll link the video uh, where she's doing her cigar boxes. That way you guys can watch it. Look at that. And then there's this one. See, all the work is already done. All you gotta do is just glue this in your book. And then there's a hawk. Hawk is a general term used to describe the entire group of predatory birds. Pound for pound, their wings are stronger than an airplane's. Red-tailed hawks have excellent vision. They can detect colors like most humans can, as well as the ultraviolet range. I think that's what it says. And there's... 
They seemed to come suddenly upon happiness as if they had surprised a butterfly in the winter woods. Oh, I like that. I'll have to copy this and put it, put a copy of it in my daughter's uh, journal. There's another paper clip. Uh, question, in which Australian city can you go on the Sound of Music tour? Answer, Salzburg. Interesting. Couple of paper clips. Another tag. And a couple of cards. That is so cool. And here's another tag. See, you guys, you get tons of stuff in, in her box. Okay, I'm going to slide this back in the box. That way we can do the book. I know this is going to be a long video. Um, maybe I'll stop this one. Let me put you up. I'll stop this here. I'll get all this back in the box. And I'll come back with part two. So I'll be right back, you guys. Bye.